Hey guys, what's up? It's Mario Sasha 2007 here for my room tour for 2019. Now this is gonna be the um first room tour I've done in about um I say about seven to six months. But without further ado, let's just get right into it. This is where you normally walk in from downstairs. I'm not I don't know where I'm showing you this. And there's my kitten or cat mocha. It has Gallade on it, my favorite Pokemon. I think I put it on here like about October of 2017 when I first moved into this room. But anyway, enough rambling. <laughs> that here's the room. Um I was doing a little bit of work on it today. So we'll go from left to right. So as you can see the first thing, well you didn't see it, but the first thing is you see these two posters, the Super Nintendo and this Pokemon Indigo League poster. This one I got from um, the Super Nintendo Classic Edition. It's kind of ruined, but um, why not? I mean, it's still durable. I mean, it's still able to be put up, so yeah. And here's the Indigo League with the golden frame. Um, this is like probably my favorite poster in here so far. It has Pikachu and other Kyanto starters. It has Ash Ketchum from season one and two and three and four and five. Well, that's the clothes he was wearing. So next we have the Amiibos. Now I don't have every Smash Bros. Amiibo or every Amiibo for that matter. I'm only into collecting Smash Bros. Amiibos and the only ones I'm missing are Toon Link, King DDD, Meta Knight, Toon Link, wait, I said Toon Link twice, um, Bowser Jr. and Cloud Corn and Bayonetta and their player two counterparts. I'm also missing the newer ones that came out when Ultimate released because I just got Ultimate. I did Yeah. My collection is still growing. I have a lot of 3DS games, probably where my collection is the best. Then I have my few Nintendo Switch titles. I have a um, beat up 3DS box. A box for um, a motion projector, as you can see. Then we have the Deluxe Essential Handbook and the Super Deluxe Essential Handbook for um, 2016 and 2018 respectively and then we got the pre-order on um, things I got from um, GameStop if you pre-order Smash Bros you would get a few um, things including a poster some thumbsticks you see them right there like little thumbsticks you put on your controllers see I play Fortnite so I don't put them on but I put them on once and I had them on for a while but I took them off they're somewhere in my room here's my DBA used for my Pokemon Let's Play that's still going on um, my Game Boy Color, my second Game Boy Color, my DSi, my new Nintendo 3DS XL, which is broken. Um, when my cell phone missing, I lost my childhood DSi, which I'm really upset about. And I lost my working new Nintendo 3DS XL and my 3DS XL, my blue one. Then we got a few Pokemon cards from the McDonald's toys with the legendary Pokemon. Then we move down another row, and then we have my headphones, which is why I don't have AirPods. Um, we got a few Wii remotes, we got the um, NES controller, SNES, S64, GameCube, Wii, um, the Super Nintendo Classic, my custom spray painted controller with um, permanent marker too, two nunchucks, and some wall outlets. And then on the last shelf, we have some boxes for my Super Nintendo and my Nintendo Entertainment System. Not in that order. And then we have the, big, the best thing that I got from pre-ordering Smash Bros at GameStop this um poster is a little bent as you can see right here but that's like the only thing wrong with it i'm trying to get a frame for it soon i'm looking for a 7 by 11 frame so yeah all right so now the next thing we have is the couch now it used to be a bed it's a futon i can train it to whatever i want whether it's a couch or a bed but i want to conserve space so i turned it into a couch and it's not bad i got my pokemon pillowcase right there Nothing right there. I'm still debating on what I should put right there. So yeah, my windows. I'll just let you see. Not really out here to see. All you can see is me. Oh yeah, if you can see, I have red hair. I dyed it. It's not natural. I dyed it. So don't even get any ideas. So out there, it's just snow. Probably why you can't see anything. And because my lights on. Wait. Do that. Don't want any pedophiles getting into my windows. Then we have my chair with some clothes on it from washing. Then we have a Wii shelf. Now, I would put games there and some other accessories for Wii, but I really don't have enough in the first place, so I might put it in my closet until I do so. 
Then we have, um, actually I'll say that for later. Then, don't mind that stuff, that's just takeaway food, obviously. Then we have on my consoles, now we have the NES and the SNES, which are both not plugged up because I use my Super Nintendo Classic and my Nintendo Classic to play retro games. Then we have my N64, Smash Bros, one of the rarest games, not to brag or anything. Then we have my GameCube with a Mario cap. We have my Nintendo Switch all the way back there. My second Wii, I used to have two Wiis. If you saw my last room tour, which was like a year ago, I had two Wiis, but one of them went missing. You'll see a lot of things in that, um, um not walkthrough. You'll see a lot of things in that room tour that are not here to this day because some of the stuff went missing and some stuff I just threw away. Then we have my Wii U and my gamepad. The gamepad's broken, if you saw the room tour from like seven months ago. Then we have my Super Nintendo Classic. I'm yet to get a Nin Nintendo Classic, the NES. Then we have a few more Mario Party 5 plushes. We got Toad, Wario, and Donkey Kong. Wait, no. Donkey Kong, Wario, then Toad. That's my regular Toad. I'm not selling that. Those are the thumbtacks I was talking about for um, pre-ordering Smash Bros. And right here, you can um, see like this little pin I got. Now, I got this pin for um, buying DK, Wario, and Yoshi on eBay by Nadashiko Japan, or however you say that stupid name. So then we got my Nintendo 3DS cases, um, cases for my Wii games, and my Nintendo Switch controller, which needs to be charged. And last but not least, we have this big shelf full of just nothing but bits and bobs. So we have the Super Mar new Super Mario Bros. DS um, cartridge case. I put it there because that's the only DS case I have, so that's pretty cool. We have a Piranha Plant, can't wait for him and Smash. We have Baby Mario sitting in his mouth. Then we have the new Nintendo 3DS box, my iPhone XR box, my Super Nintendo box, um, my Metal Mario Amiibo, or Silver, whatever you want to call it. You have a sealed um, Princess Peach Amiibo from Smash, um, sealed Daisy Wobble Luigi from Mario. Then we have two Nintendo Switches because for some reason the douchebag who stole my stuff decided to steal my um, Nintendo Switch so I had to um, buy a whole new one, which was unfortunate because I lost a lot of good things on there. Then we have Yoshi, Luigi, and Mario. Then we have an Abe Mario. Then we have some more boxes. And then we have Bowser and then Peach. And that is my Nintendo collection. There's also my closet. Um, that has a lot of stuff in it, but I don't think you're really interested in my closet. So I'm just going to close that. So, yeah, that's my Nintendo room. Well, guys, I hope you enjoyed the room tour. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure to leave a like, subscribe, and comment. Um... And give me some suggestions on what I should do with my room because I'm always available to suggestions from my um, my subscribers and my fans. So other than that, I will see you in the next episode, which will most likely be a Pokemon video. So yeah, peace out guys.